Hey everybody, how you doing? Today we have a special new video today. It's about Final Fantasy XIV uh, on the PlayStation 5. This is the PlayStation, uh, this is Final Fantasy uh, Online. And we're going to show you the, um, you know, the, the controller as you can see here on how to navigate and my experience playing this game using the PlayStation 5 controller. Uh, it's a, actually a very, very special uh, thing. Let me just quickly show you. Number one, uh, you can use the touchpad here uh, in the PlayStation 5 controller as a mouse. Like here, as you can see, you can navigate through the touch controller over here, and you can easily select whatever you want by just clicking uh, the X button. Or you can just use the uh, you know the uh, arrows up and down to navigate the menu. As you can see, so you can click start. And once you click start, you can go inside the game and play it straight away. It takes a little bit of time to uh, to be able to uh, get used to it, actually. But just give me a second. <clears throat> okay. So here is the menu, as you can see. Uh, typically R2, L2 here. With the, with the navigation here so you're gonna use like l2 r1 l1 r2 l2 to navigate the, into the menu and you're gonna use the analog stick to use the camera just like any uh game for example just like the the souls game dark souls and stuff like that so what i'm about to do right now i'm going to show you how to navigate so you got use the arrow up and down and left to right just to navigate and it's actually very small 60 fps uh, on the PlayStation 5 it looks really great so you have a couple of menu as you can see here so how to navigate you just click on the um, the middle touchpad to navigate through the whatever menus pop in your screen so once you get for example this menu over here I can just click on the right click X to remove it and usually what comes inside uh, when you play the game here is, um, you know, the menus, the things that, updates that happened and you can remove the quest, for example, this area. Now it's in the recommendations, just can just simply click the circle button and just be removed. Now let's talk about the action uh, buttons over here. So this is the, your character's action. And you can see R2 here and you can see L2. Um, so what does that mean? Um, so here with the PlayStation 5 controller what you can do is you, you click on the R2 and you can see you can access these uh, figures once you I'm holding actually R2 so once you hold the R2 you'll have a uh, triangle X circle and uh, square so, so you can choose between these uh, sorry here there you go so you can see it on the right side here you can see uh, the, the figure so if I click now, for example, triangle. Let's click triangle. That's one skill I've used right now. Circle. And square. Once you click square, you get this uh, um, figure over here. So you got that. So what about the, uh, the next, this area over here? So this area over here, how can we work with it? Uh, you're going to use the arrows here. This is like the arrows of right, left, up and down to activate these things. See? So basically, what I have to do is just hold R2 and click on the action command. It depends on what um, navigation you put it on. Uh, now we have to put it, if you use L2 though, you're going to open the command over here on the left side. And you can use, for example, same thing, up and down, right, left. And then can use the... Uh, X uh, circle X triangle uh, to you know have the other side um, so basically this is how to actually navigate the action um, into place in the what do you call it uh, Final Fantasy Online um, pretty straightforward but you have to get used to it I, I took me maybe a couple of times uh, four or five times to get used to it uh, but overall, it's playable. And if, 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 like, for example, Warcraft, World of Warcraft, uh, apply the same concept in PlayStation 5, it's, it's doable, guys. So here you can see 
And by the way, you can jump easily, like quick triangle. You will jump. So that's uh, that's really nice. Um, uh, basically, this is what I do. So, if you want to go to the, for example, the quest is over here on the top left. If you want to go to the quest, all I have to do is just click this navigation button, and then click X. It's going to show you the quest line of where I am right now, or actually, where's the quest? Once you click X again, for example, um, you have to see where where's the quest is over here. So it's on the left side. And you can see here is where I am. So, if you if you can if you have hard time to see what's in the map, all you have to do is just hold L1 and just zoom in, zoom in and zoom out. So pretty, pretty straightforward. It's a big map, you know. Uh, I'm still enjoying the game. It's fun. Um, it comes to the uh, you know progress and story and stuff like that, and also putting gear on and having fun enjoying the gameplay it's it's a it's a fun it's a fun game to play actually and progress it's different than world of warcraft definitely like leveling in world of warcraft is like you grind to get to the top level here it's kind of you enjoy your time until you get to the next level basically this is how i see it now this is just a brief video guys um to show you what uh uh, or how to actually work with the uh, uh, controller, PlayStation 5 controller, uh, playing pl um, Final Fantasy Online on the PlayStation 5. If you have any questions, hit me up in the comment section below. Uh, thank you, everybody, and see you in another video.